Hello guys, welcome to my third long video. This video is going to be about uh, my stretching routine. Well, this is really something that I can imagine my morning without. So, I'm gonna show you the way I stretch and I'll tell you some beneficial things about it. So before we get into this, I would like to mention that um, first of all, it can prevent your injury. Whether you train hard in gym or not, it's always good to prevent something than to be sorry that you know. The second thing is um, it can improve your posture. A lot of people tend to bend over and uh, sit in really weird positions while they're working. So this is something that can help too. Other things are, uh, it is truly, truly great for stress relief. Um, I can feel and I can tell by myself like it helps me a lot to reduce the stress and and everything. I just I just feel like I got uh, my mind is free. I mean, it helps me to clear my mind and I'm ready to start a productive day right after stretching session. So yeah, guys, do stretching. It's it's amazing thing. If you're a beginner, I think like five to ten minutes is enough for you. It's like it's important to not overdo it, especially if you are a beginner, you don't want to hurt yourself or something like that. There must be a little discomfort every time if you want to like uh, push forward, but not too much, like you, you shouldn't be hurt. Um, so yeah, let's just get into this. So guys, usually I start with this exercise, with this sitting in the squat. This can improve your squat technique drastically. It also helps to increase the mobility of your ankles. So yeah, I definitely recommend this one. Just to sit down, make yourself feel comfortable and push the knees away. Like the experts say, it's really healthy, this kind of sitting. Alright, then I usually move to this exercise. I don't know what is its name, but it's my favorite one. Just pushing my weight from side to side and stretching the hamstrings. I forgot to mention that stretching can also help you with the lower back pain. Once you stretch your hamstrings and your lower back, you will recognize the difference. That's why I also stretch. Like I used to have problems with the lower back pain. Since I stretch and I work out, I don't feel anything no more. <laughs> Then I usually do this exercise, and it's called the uh, butterfly. So we try to squeeze our knees and push them away again, but down the ground. We can also move with our legs a bit to try to increase flexibility that way. And I can guarantee you, you will feel better. Much better. Let's do the split.
Firstly, try to sit in this position. Your legs will be probably like this, because um, you don't got this range yet. But uh, try to stretch to one leg, to another leg, and slowly you will get these two. It just needs to be regular, like make yourself a routine. Someone like me will like to stretch in the morning, but some people prefer it before they go to bed or in the evening when they get some spare time after work, so it's up on you. Don't just do this uh, static stretching before actual training in the gym because this wouldn't go well. So otherwise you can do it whenever you want, like basically. So just find the time that fits you, that suits you. Alright, we must not forget about knee to chest. Sometimes I rotate it. I can feel the relief in my lower back when doing this and I rotate it outside. Yeah. So this is something you can try. Some better technique and I I'm sure you will appreciate it. So this is my favorite exercise to stretch your quadriceps, but it's more advanced. So it's time to stretch our glutes now. Usually I do this exercise for it. And I have a couple of more. Yeah, I'm sure you will appreciate this to help stretch your glutes. With this exercise, you should try to be relaxed as much as possible and try to breathe out completely. The next exercise that I'm going to show you is called frog. And it stretches your ham hamstrings and adductors, the inner legs. So, it's called frog because in this position and you can find this very useful especially during one activity <laughs> well it looks like this we breathe out What we're gonna do 
now we are going to stretch the quads, the biggest leg muscles. And we use very simple exercise for it. Basically, you will just grab your ankle and pull it back. I guess neighbor's baby. You can try to pull back also the thigh. Then it becomes even, even more demanding, difficult and Recently I started also with another thing and that is uh, neck stretching. I found it really good, especially for the people who are complaining about the headache, migraine and this type of difficulties. It can really help because uh, sometimes we are looking hard for the pills and it's really not necessary. Sometimes the good stretch and the massage of the neck can really help and we don't need to take any pills and stuff like that, so try this guys. Oh, I heard a crack. The other side. Again, we are not pushing. We are just slowly stretching. the head. trying to pull the chin up and above us. So pull the chin above you. Also, I would like to show you the stretching of the spin. Well, at least one exercise that I started to do. And since I do this, I feel even better than I used to. So really, I think, I think unexpected. <laughs> So what I do, I don't know if it even exists, but um, I started to do this. This position. <laughs> 